it. What's up, guys? Mad Money Banks. Right now, I'm about to show you how to do that clan tag glitch that everybody's doing with the L3 and R3. Those symbols on their clan tag and stuff. I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So, um, here's a picture right here of um, how it looks like. So, check it out. Tell, you, you know you want it. So, listen up because I'm about to tell you how to get it with the PS3. Alright, first what you want to do is get a keyboard for your PS3. Now, I know a lot of you are thinking about... Hey, I don't have that keyboard for my controller. I don't have that because it's too much. It's 50 bucks. I don't want to go out and buy it. Me either. I tried to get it from another guy to um, let me post his video on my channel so it can help his channel and mine. But he didn't want to go for it. So I kept thinking there's got to be another way. And I know most of you don't got that keyboard that clicks onto your controller. So I found out another way. All you have to do is use any old keyboard. Just like the one in the picture right there. Just use a keyboard just like that. I went downstairs, snatched it off my desktop computer, plugged it straight to my PS3. So now what you want to do is you want to go to accessories and pretty much change the keyboard. What is it called? Change the keyboard type. You want to change it. It's probably on English standard, US standard. You want to change it to Dutch keyboard. All right. Once you have that, you just back out. So after it's on Dutch keyboard, you just start up the game. Go to your game and start it up. Alright, when you load the game up, you go straight to multiplayer and press play online so you can get to your clan tag. Let it load up. After it's loaded, you go straight to your call sign and you go to your clan tag. Now you erase everything that you got in your clan name. So once you have everything erased in your clan name, now what you want to do on the keyboard, go straight to the keyboard, you can set your PS3 controller down. What you want to do is, for some reason mine won't work on the left, control and alt, so I on the right it works perfectly, so it'd be like you have the control and alt button and the space bar, then you have another alt button and a control button for most American keyboards. So you want to use an HP keyboard, I'm not sure about the Mac keyboard because that's a little more difficult I'm sure, but you can kind of substitute the uh, controls and it should work. But for some reason it won't work on the left alt and control, but use the right alt and control of your keyboard. You want to hold alt and control down and press 4. That'll give you a 1 fourth symbol. That 1 fourth symbol means L3. I don't know exactly why, I don't know why it works. But you put one fourth by holding control, alt, and pressing the four. I'll put it down in the description for you guys that don't understand. And that will give you this, that L3 button right in my clan tag. Now, for you guys that want to learn how to, you can put as many L3 buttons as you want. But for you guys that want to learn how to do the R3 button, you go, you go right back to your clan tag. But you can type in the control and alt and press 5. So control, alt, 5. And that will give you a one half symbol on your clan name. So then you press enter on your keyboard and that gives you the R3 button. Now for you guys that are wondering how to do both at once, you just type them in both at once. So you bring back up your clan tag. And then you go and press control, alt, 4 and then control alt 5 and you press enter on your keyboard and it brings up both now that's only two spaces you can make four for the clan tag so let's say you want to do it again you want to have I guess double the amount then you can just do control alt 4 control alt 5 I don't know what 3 force is I actually pressed that by accident let's see what it does 3 4 just types in 3 4. Only control alt 4 and 5 work from what I found out so far. If you guys find any other numbers, put them in the comments below and I'll stick them in the description right next to your name saying that you found it and good job for you. So control alt 4 for the L3, control alt 5 for the R3. Another control alt 4 for the L3, another control alt 5 for the R3. Press enter. And now it leads straight off the screen. You can you can rearrange these any way you want, so have fun with them, guys. Now, everybody who does have a PS3 keyboard, 
it should be simple for you. It's the same way. But for all you guys just like me who can't afford to buy a $50 small little keyboard to put on your controller, take your take your desktop keyboard and stick it in. As long as it has a USB cable that's connected to it. I don't know about the wireless ones. I'm sure they're a little more complicated. But if it has a wire to it for a USB to plug into your computer, it'll plug straight to your PS3 and you can do this glitch. So have fun with it. It's been fun. And once again, I'm Mad Money Banks. Enjoy your weekend, guys. Peace. If you'd like to see more of my videos, you can click the left square for the last video, the right square for the next video, the middle square for a mystery video, and you can add me on Facebook or Twitter, and also PlayStation or Xbox. And unless you have a small penis, subscribe.